So today we're gonna be building a dinosaur zoo tycoon. So let's start with the entrance here and then let's build some path and then the ticket booth. All right guys, come in. My dinosaur zoo is open. This is Jurassic Gravy Park. So we gotta get rich guests. So we gotta get adventures. Obviously if they wanna sit down. Oh dude, he had a car. Wait, let me buy this. I wanna buy this dude. Okay, let's buy this and then, oh wait, wait, spawn. Okay, let's see if we can drive around. Oh, dude, we can drive around. Let's go. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, smash the like button and subscribe. Also, use star code great when you guys buy Robux. Okay, I gotta teleport back. Teleport. Wait, how do I teleport? Teleport. All right, there you go. All right, so what do I need to buy? Okay, we need to buy our first dinosaur enclosure. So, buy dinosaurs. Buy the habitat. Okay, double click. Oh, you can rename them. Oh, you can feed them. Wait, 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 let me get the dinosaurs. Okay, so let's buy this. So can we buy another one? Oh, buy the second one. And then, wait, why? They dropped the claw. Wait, wait, they come flying from a closet. All right, let me buy, uh, oh, there's a second one. Yeah, there's a second one. They literally drop like a closet now and they come up from the closet. That doesn't seem like the right way to do it. Okay, let's feed these things. So, so click, okay, click the dino food. Okay, click for dino food. How do I? Oh, right here. Okay, here here you go. Please don't eat me. Just eat the food. Okay, there you go. Please don't eat me. Just take the food. Here you. I gotta make sure I feed. This is the bad part about like having a di Oh my- Oh man. This is the bad part about having a dinosaur mall. It's our dinosaur zoo. Is my dinosaurs are always hungry. If I don't take care of them, I honestly don't know what might happen to me. Or my custom- Oh, you know what? I need a janitor. I need someone to clean up this place. Will you spawn a helicopter? Oh! Sky view of my place. Okay, I should buy... You know what? I'm gonna buy another habitat. Okay, so that's where everybody is. It's funny how there's barely any dinosaur habitats here. Because you can only have one or else you just have too many... Uh, You just have too many dinosaurs. Okay, so let's buy the second habitat here. So we need the grass and the plants. It looks like we're gonna have a plant eater dinosaur. Mushrooms? This Wait, this dinosaur that eat mushrooms? I didn't know that was a thing. Oh, the watering hole. Okay, they drink, obviously drink water. Okay, let's buy this. This one. Okay, there it is. We got our first dinosaur. So the plane is coming in. It's dropping our dinosaur. I don't understand why it drops it for a Oh, it's a meat eater. Never mind. Okay, there you go. Take it. There you go. You can have that food. Spawn another one. I really need like a feeder. I need someone that feeds these dinosaurs. Or else I might actually die. They might eat me. You know, if I had a dinosaur zoo, what I would do personally is I would not have any dinosaurs that eat people. Like, I would stay away from that. Like, even saber-toothed tigers. I'm cool with saber-toothed tigers. But would I have that? I don't think I would have that in my in my zoo. That seems a little bit dangerous. Like, dude, look at this. Okay, well, I guess this dinosaur can have a jeep right here. Not enough money. I'm poor. Okay, buy this. Buy sand. Yeah, I can't afford that. I need to get... Uh, let's see. We're getting an entrance. Buy all of these stuff. Oh, dude, I gotta clean up my zoo or else no one's gonna want to stay here. It's so dirty. Okay, let me make sure we keep feeding these guys. I don't want to get... Oh, dude, it's, it's raining. Bro, they poop? Wait, what? I have to collect the dinosaur poop? That's disgusting. Oh, dude. Imagine risking your life to pick up dinosaur poop. That is the worst job in the world. I, you know, honestly, at that point, you would have to pay the janitor like a million dollars a year to do that. But if I was getting paid a million dollars a year, would I even work as a janitor? I guess I would I would try to work for one year. I would see if I could survive for one year, save all my money, and then get another job. Just leave this place. I would not keep working, dude. That would be literally insane. Okay, so let me feed these guys. These guys are probably hungry. Oh, yep, they're hungry. They're pooping everywhere. They're literally pooping everywhere. Okay, feed you. And feed you. Okay, they're all happy, it looks like. This guy is hungry. Let's make sure we feed them so we don't we don't die. <laughs> we don't die. That's my motivation to feed my animals. So we don't die. <laughs> when I made the other zoo, remember when we made the other zoo? Like, we never had that motivation. It's like, yeah, you gotta feed your animals or you're gonna die. Usually the other zoo is like, if you don't feed your animals, your animals are gonna die. And then your business is gonna, you're gonna run out of business because, you know, you just wouldn't have animals. You need animals in a zoo. But in this one, if you don't feed the animals, you die. <laughs> you literally die. Okay, let's spawn another dinosaur here. Benches. I have no money, dude. Why is it $300 for a bench? It's so expensive. Okay, so my dinosaurs are going to the bathroom everywhere. Let's hire a janitor. We're gonna need this. So let's first, yeah, let's get a janitor. I think this is the most important. We're just gonna spend all our Robux. 
get a scientist. I don't know why a scientist. I guess to make better dinosaurs. Dude, that would be... Imagine if we get a scientist that can clone a T-Rex to make him eat only mushrooms. That would literally be the best guy. And then we can get a tour guide. So walk around your park describing things. Dude, that's cool. Okay, respawn, respawn, respawn. Respawn! So now I have a janitor that does everything. Well, let me just help him out. I'm gonna collect the poop. Because I kind of feel bad. And then I gotta also feed these dinosaurs. I do not want to eat them. I don't want the guy... Imagine the guy, the first day of work, he comes in and the dinosaurs are hungry. That's like the worst first job. <laughs> you come in and you have to feed hungry dinosaurs. Dude, that would be like the worst job ever. Uh, collect this and collect... Dude, you get money for collecting the dinosaur poop. <laughs> That's so ridiculous. Alright, let's continue building. Let's build the balloon stand. Let's build... Oh, Triceratops! Dude, this is my favorite dinosaur, Triceratops! These guys are awesome. They're like kind of like right. They're related to rhinos. See, triceratops are cool because they're kind of dangerous. These are really cool dinosaurs. You know, they will like kind of stab you with their horns, but they only eat plants. I'm pretty sure they're oh dino pet store. Oh, that's cool, dude. You can get pets. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's buy a tree. Paths. Okay. Um, where's my dinosaurs, dude? Don't you want me to make that? Oh wait, 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 wait. Stop telling me to go over there. I need to buy my triceratops. Okay, buy this. Okay, Triceratops. Let's go. Dude, look at that closet. That's a big closet right there. <laughs> I wonder where I'm stealing these dinosaurs from. <laughs> I'm literally stealing these guys from like another area. <laughs> I'm just stealing them from somewhere. Okay, let's go. You know what I just realized? I don't actually make money from customers. I don't make money from buying new dinosaurs. I make money collecting dinosaurs feces. That's literally how I make money. Because I just realized, because when I was clicking it, I was gaining a bunch of money. Dude, that's kind of disgusting. Oh, $5,000. Okay, that's expensive. Forget that. Forget that. I'm just going to follow what this thing is telling me to do. All right, buy this. Buy this. I'm too poor for everything. I'm literally too poor, dude. You can't tell me what to do. 600 I'm literally too poor. I need more. Okay, let's do this. I'm spending all of the money, guys. We're going all out. Dude, that was 500 Robux. That's kind of expensive, to be honest. Okay, buy mushrooms. Oh, this place looks cool. Oh, I can sprint! I didn't realize I had sprint this whole time. Dude, if I knew I had sprint, I would have been sprinting this whole time. Okay, before we leave this place... Wait, I gotta spawn another one. Boom! Alright, we got another triceratops. And then we gotta figure out what goes in this area. They literally have a waterfall. See, this is a nice... Dude, they have eggs! Okay, probably not a T-Rex. I don't think there's a T-Rex. But that's my ultimate thing. Oh, Brachiosaurus. That's cool. Alright, let's go here. Dude, that's a huge closet. The closet is just getting bigger and bigger. How does that helicopter carry it? Oh, dude, that's a thing. That's, um, what's what's that What's that show? They're really old. Oh, dude, you can feed them vegetables. Hey, yo. <laughs> These dinosaurs are weird. They're so big. They're like giraffes. They're related to giraffes, dude. They're like, um, what's a dinosaur show? The Land Before Time. <laughs> it's the Land Before Time dinosaurs. It's literally the same one. All right, let's buy another one. And then let's go into over here. I hope this balloon store is making a lot of money, dude. I spent, I invested a lot to buy that balloon store. I hope it's making an insane amount of money. Okay, so where, what are we building here? A dome. Okay, this looks like all the birds. Okay, these are the pterodactyls. Okay, no wonder we need a dome, dude. We don't want them to escape. Okay, let's see. Purchase this. And then, yeah, these are the birds. Okay, I gotta buy all this stuff. Dude, there's so much... Oh, bathrooms. Finally, it's funny. You know what I think? If I had a business, I think the first thing I would build is a bathroom. Because I feel like a lot of people go to restaurants and stuff or places just use the bathroom. I mean, probably before COVID, like, before, like, all this was happening, they would definitely go to the... They would definitely use the bathroom. All right, where is this? How, how did you just glitch in there, dude? This plane is cheating. Okay, there you go. And then we can feed this guy so he doesn't get... Oh, this guy eats meat? Wait, I didn't know... that. Wait, I didn't know this was a meat eater. I thought he ate grass. I guess it does make sense because if you think of birds, what do they do? They kind of fall down and they take like snakes and like little rats and stuff. That's usually what they eat. What is this? By ancient giant exhibit. Wait, this giant? Wait. Oh yeah, weren't like people giants before? Bro, this is like a giant person, really? Dude. Was this actually a thing? Yo. That guy is huge, dude. He should play for the NBA. That guy is huge. How do I feed him? Here you go, dude. 
I'm gonna feed you. <laughs> there you go. Take a piece of meat. I'm gonna feed you, giant human. You know what? There's like dinosaurs in his habitat. I don't know how he's gonna deal with these crocodiles. <laughs> Literally in his habitat. There's probably not. He's not gonna have a good time doing this. So let's put this. And let's put this. So can he actually have... Dude, how is he gonna have these crocodiles? Literally in his own habitat. Well, let's make sure this guy has food. You know what? Knowing humans, they would probably team up on that crocodile and kind of eat them. So that's why I'm gonna buy more to even out the match. So the crocodiles have a chance. But either way, the crocodiles probably gonna trick the things because humans are just too OP. Like if you say, what is the most dangerous species in all of Earth? I would technically say it's humans because they just took over everything and they have the potential to just take over every environment over time and destroy the whole world. But you could say that, what about, what if dinosaurs had the potential to do that? You don't know. Was there any smart dinosaurs? Like, I feel like over time, there might have been like a dinosaur. Because dinosaurs were huge. What if there was a dinosaur that just grew with like a big brain? Like, see, these guys, these guys had small brains. Like, these guys have big, like, lower sides and uh, small brains. What if they had a giant brain <laughs> and a smaller oversize? It's just like a giant brain, uh, a giant brain thing. I guess they would die from T-Rex. But that wouldn't be the point. The point would be, they would have to be so smart that they would have to out, like, brain the T-Rex. That would be, like, the only way. So I think that is possible. Because that is kind of like survival of the fittest. Because if you're, you're smart enough to survive, you see, if you're smart enough. So it doesn't matter if you have, like, literally a T-Rex chasing you. If you're just so smart that you could just, like, outplan, you could, like, track the T-Rex's habitats and where they're moving and stuff. And then you can keep them in some place. You can use baits and stuff like that. It'll be pretty much like humans, but as dinosaurs. It'll be human. I guess it would be like these giants. But I wouldn't think these giants are that smart because they don't even have like... They don't even have tanks and missiles. Like that's what humans have against dinosaurs. If a, dinosaur's a if a dinosaur ever comes against a human, they would just have a rocket launcher. Like what would a dinosaur do? I was actually thinking about that before. Like imagine if dinosaurs are real. Like at this point, like dinosaurs had to be real before. But if they spawn in like now, because usually when there's a movie about dinosaurs, they're usually like in an underworld like ice area that no one has found before. It's like a hidden area. But if like people found that out, dude, they would tranquilize all the dinosaurs. They would have rocket launchers. They would literally have a, like a Jurassic World in real life. And if somehow the dinosaurs get out of hand, they have a whole military. Like there's no way the dinosaurs, literally there's zero chance the dinosaurs will win against humans. It is my opinion. Now you could say like Godzilla is different because Godzilla, in Godzilla's case. So what Godzilla has, Godzilla can absorb radiation. So if we shoot, like, missiles and stuff... Wait, can I absorb missiles? I know they can absorb, like, if you nuke them and stuff. But is it... I don't know. I haven't watched the movie, but I think it's like that, right? Can they, like, absorb, like, if you shoot rockets at them? Because if they couldn't, why wouldn't we... Why wouldn't we just shoot rockets at Godzilla? <laughs> That's what I'm not even thinking about. You should just shoot a rocket at Godzilla and you would end your problem. Now I gotta go build out the Ice Age over here. The Ice Age, guys. Who remember those old movies? Those old Ice Age movies? Do they still make those? I love that little squirrel who was always chasing the peanut. He was so funny, dude. He was... That, that was my favorite character. Like, they had this little shorts of, like, the squirrel. Oh, dude, it's like a buffalo, dude. Wait, I want to feed him. Here you go, dude. Here we go. See, this guy's a nice guy. He doesn't eat meat. Like, he doesn't eat people. Like, if I see a... Oh, Sabertooth Tiger! Oh, these guys are the best. Why does Sabertooth Tigers go extinct? I feel like they're so practical animals. I mean, a tiger with a giant teeth. I guess the, the only bad part is if they fell and they broke their teeth. Oh, man. Imagine how painful that would be. Imagine just how painful that would be. If you're a saber tooth tiger and you fell down and you broke one of those giant teeth, oh dude, the pain would be unreal. And of course, uh, cats eat stuff. Cats eat people. That's their main thing. Here you go. Please don't eat me, cat. <laughs> Please don't eat me a part of you. Please, kitty. Here, kitty, dude. Here, kitty. Please don't eat me. If you think I'm scared of like all these dinosaurs, no, I'm scared of the cats being hungry. Because, dude, when cats are upset, that's when you have a problem, guys. And I get upset if you don't hit the like button. So hit the like button right now. Because you don't know how I feel when I'm upset. The woolly mammoth. Oh, dude. We got a woolly mammoth. Let's spot it. Oh, free. Nice. You see, that first one's free. Oh, wow. The box is kind of tiny, dude. Dude, these dinosaurs would eat these woolly mammoths for, like, dinner. The box is literally tiny. Wait, let me buy some more gold. Oh, dude, I'm out of Robux. 
I'm literally out of Robux. I have no Robux left. Ah, oh, dude, I gotta wait now because I'm poor, dude. All right, well, let's feed these guys while I wait. So this is my park so far. It looks absolutely amazing. But here's our final challenge. We have one million dollars. And it's time to finally get the table. This what will destroy my park forever. The T-Rex enclosure. They literally have lasers because they know this is a horrible idea. This is literally the only enclosure that they have a little laser, dude. They need laser technology to just stop the T-Rex from eating people. From getting out and just eating everybody. Oh, well, well, here we go, guys. Three, two, one. We are getting our first T-Rex. Dude, that's the scariest closet i ever seen in my life. And it's raining. This is a bad deal, dude. Let's feed this guy. Maybe he's a nice dinosaur. Yeah, let's let's feed him. Honestly, I really don't think these little T-bones right here are gonna get, make this T-Rex happy. Like, I'm probably gonna have to feed him, like, at least, like, 100 of these per day. I would give this T-Rex 100 of uh, these meats per day, and he would still eat me. He would be like, yo, I'm still hungry. How about I eat you? And there you go, guys. We purchased the last T-Rex. So we are officially done with the Dinosaur Jurassic Park Tycoon. Or the zoo, I guess. Yeah, this is my zoo. I love the view from the volcano. It looks awesome. We did it. We finally finished our zoo tycoon. Let's go. All right, guys. If you enjoyed, smash the like, subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you next one.